Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today. I'm Jackie and I create mosaics using sea glass. And today I'm going to talk to you about creating a landscape with mosaics. And this is part two. So the mosaic that I wanted to talk to you today, or talk to you about today, is this one. And this is a mosaic of our, I call it our beach, because this is our beach where we go to our cottage. And this is actually the beach where I collect most of my sea glass. So when I've been collecting sea glass all summer long, I find I get really sad when I have to leave the beach. And last summer I decided that I was going to take a nice picture of the beach and take a bunch of my sea glass home. And during the winter when I couldn't be at the beach, I was going to create a sea glass mosaic. So this is the one I created. So this is the picture that I took of our beach that I wanted to depict in a mosaic. So I just did a simple line drawing of the beach with the capes and the water and sky. And then I cut it in three because I was using a window that had grills in it. So then when you put the sea glass on, you can see it looks like you're looking through the window out at the beach. So just a few details I'd point out. I found this incredible red piece and to me it looked like a sail. So I wanted to use that in a sailboat. So I did um, use that in this piece. And a few other things, I used some blue to make some birds up in the sky. Here's another bird that I put in. I find those great blue triangles good for that. And I put three little cottages up on the cape to represent some cottages that sit on our cape here. And I like to put some little extra things in, like a little piece of glass or a shell on top of other pieces. And I put two anukshaks uh, on the beach, showing people walking on the beach. And here's some shells and rocks that I put down at the bottom of the beach. And I put in a couple of turtles, mother turtle and a baby turtle. And I used some white sea glass to make seagulls sitting on the beach. We often see a lot of seagulls along our beach. And here's a couple of people sitting on a rock looking out over the water. So some more rocks and shells there and seagulls. And I like to use some of the darker green to create some texture and waves in the water. So you can see in the big picture some of the details that I've pointed out to you. I think it does a good job depicting what our beach looks like. Thanks for joining me today and listening to what I have to say about creating a landscape from a photograph. And I hope that you enjoyed it. So if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post them and I'll get back to you on them. And subscribe to my YouTube channel to see all my future videos. And you can check out my website at JackieTrimperSeaGlass.com. Mm -hmm.